Welcome back, everyone. So today is actually the 5th. This starts Monday the 9th. And I have a lot going on this week. I actually, this is the first vacation my husband and I are going to have ever since the world locked down. We are just doing a short vacation. And it is going to be going to Megacon. Um, I used to actually be a vendor at Megacon in the different cons around uh, where I did special effects makeup and wigs. This is actually gonna be a true vacation because I'm not working. This is gonna be relaxing. So I've got the schedule written out here. I have stickers from Poopa's Prints. And then I also grabbed my binder. Now this is an Erin Condren binder. This is their champagne color. And what I've done in here is I actually, I do put a cover, uh, interchangeable cover back and front in here because otherwise they, a lot of times the folders or paper will get stuck um, in the clasp area. And this just keeps it from doing that. It makes it easier for me to close it up and all. So this is one of the Erin Condren um, posty notes. This one is the Flora. This one is mid-century circles, and then I have another one coming in. Hint, hint, they're get birthday gifts, so that's why they're still in the wrapper. This is actually one of the pocket folders that came from my Flora nine, I'm sorry, seven by nine planner. I took out this so I can add in um, uh, two months for what the planner didn't have. So this came with that. This is also the sticker book that I bought to go with it. It's very um, heavy paper, which I like. And it also matches the flora. Now, like you, I, I've said in previous videos, I'm not a big decorator. So you can see how much of this I have used right now. But I do plan on using it for certain things and I'll probably use it um, for the event that we're gonna be talking about now. Now I also do um, journal, the nail journals. So I have papers in here for it, as well as some of the clear stickers. I'll make sure to link up here where I got all of the stickers um, these are larger stickers. Um, this is a sticker pack that I ordered from, um, I believe it's Cosmic Artist. I'll make sure the link is down below. I love her work. The one thing that I want to do want to mention, um, when you're an artist, it is very enjoyable to be able to admire other artists, and I really love the moodiness of her work. Um, I just, I really enjoy her work. So a lot of the large images of art pieces that I love, I've actually put in a specialty journal. So I have papers in here. Um, for the journal also, newsprint papers, music papers, some more of Erin Condren stickers. Um, so I just fill this how I need. And then my perpetual calendar is in here. Before I start working on this, I do have one other. And I do subscribe to Erin Condren's sticker um, group, club. And so every month, she sends those out quarterly. So you get three months every time and you'll have stickers for that month that are color coded. So we're no longer in July. So I have not changed that. And then this is also an Erin Condren, what's called a petite for, uh, polio, folio. That's what I meant, folio. And I also got the added um, plastic holders in here so that I can put the smaller stuff, as you can see. 
three pockets on one side, two larger on the inside. And then the opposite side of this is going to be a large pocket. And I just, I haven't put anything in there recently. I may actually put my Poopas prints in there. Um, so here's from other months, and I'm going to, while I'm here, find my August. So I know I'm going to be use, needing to use the heart checklist. And let's go through here. And since we're doing a cosplay, so I'm going to make sure that I have my We Can Do It Rosie the Riveter style in here. And I think I'm gonna go for the blonde one this time. We're not gonna need the bridal. Of course, you could do bridal for that. Um, we've got sunglasses and shoes. Good ideas. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna probably grab the joy out of this one. And then Let's see here. Well, there's a happy vacation. This is our vacation. And since we're talking cosplay, let's go ahead and grab some Wonder Woman. And I'll be taking a lot of photos, so. Okay, I've looked at my calendar on the computer and I already know what I have on the books for this week. So I'm gonna go ahead and quickly uh, write all that in and I'll fast forward this. Why don't I grab one of Erin Condren's? Since I said I've got to start using them, I'll grab a new one. It's a dusty pink. I'm not a pink fan, but I will... For all those who like to follow Erin Condren's colors, I will do that. There we go. One of the things I think I would like to do in here is use one of Erin Condren's sayings. Inspiration, so... I will carefully pull that up. And this is great because I am reading a book called The Story of With. And it's a great book for people who are creative artist, creative in, in all aspects. So this is the story of With by Alan Arnold and I recommend this big time. This is gonna help me with that because this is good, like I said, this is gonna be a hectic week. And then since I'm going, this has already got me set up from 11.45, which the DMV, I don't know how long that's gonna take me even though I've got an appointment. So let's go ahead and put in a, oh, well, might as well do the pink. We'll do a list. I need to do Ashley's nails for her cosplay outfit. I'm not quite sure at this moment what else I'll be doing on Tuesday. Tuesday's becoming a conglomerate of, oh my gosh, I got too much to do. Coffee, 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 coffee. Let's see. Let me grab and throw around my August to-dos. Now, I'm not so much worried right now on times, mainly because nothing is set time-wise. Yeah, and I let that go a little too long. So 
So let's move that in. And I actually might take the to-do off, or I might cover it. I don't know yet. There we go. But that is priority for that day. So I need to pack. And then, now on vacation, I will come back and on the day of, just like everything before, I will fill in and check off and everything how I'm going to be doing. Because I actually might be making this, these lists over here. Not sure. It depends on that day. The first day of our vacation is going to be Thursday. And I want to celebrate it with Lauren's happy vacation. And I'm actually going to go ahead and white out the date so that happy vacation is the focal point, right like that. Okay. Now this says month goals, but I'm going to go ahead and use it for on here because I need to get everything um, squared away before my niece, my uh, nephew and my niece and their son come over to take care of our cats and stay here and have their own little vacation. Let's do Wonder Woman instead of monthly. Let's put the Wonder Woman over top of that. This is cosplay. There we go, perfect. Okay, from there, it's time for fun. Now, I do know that on Saturday, because that's the big day where everybody comes out with all of their costumes and everything like that, I do know that day we'll be taking a lot of photos. Also, Ashley's coming over to our hotel room and I will be doing her hair and makeup for that. And I might as well put in the cardio sticker somewhere in here. And since, let me look on Friday's schedule. It starts at one. So I'm gonna put my cardio sticker here because we are gonna be hoofing it over to the convention. That's everything on that schedule. And now is time to, let's do a little bit of decorating for our vacation. We are going to, I'm gonna add in some arrows here and there from Erin Condren's set. Just to fancy this up. So since I need to slow down, this is more of a let's chill out and relax. 
I'm definitely going to put one of those we can do it here because relaxing is one of the things that I have the worst time with. My husband has said for pretty much the 20 years we've been married that I don't know the meaning of that word. I kind of would like to find out. And Megacon is done. We are home. We're here. And it was a crazy week. All right. Monday was the calm before the storm. So I was able to get a few things in. But you can see I had to change my sticker list for Tuesday. It was crazy. Uh, Steve and I happened to stance, went ahead and went to separate cars, which was a good thing when we saw Heather. Because my appointment went over. And I was not able to come home really quick, nor was I able to get any coffee. Oh, but that's okay. Um, I had to go straight to the DMV. The DMV put a complete wrench in the whole system because I was there for two and a half hours. Wow. Did not make it to x-rays. I was five minutes late for my eye appointment, although I did get my glasses, which are great. Linnea messaged me asking if I can go ahead and fix her nails before we left. So I went ahead and did that and then came home and activated our convention badges. All of this I got started on, but it went to the next day. And then you can also see I have a longer list here, which I was not expecting to have to add this onto, but that's okay. Got all of this done. It did overflow onto Thursday, which was okay. We Check-in was at four, I think we got there at five. Went over to the convention for about an hour and then came back. The only downfall on that day is they didn't bother to turn the AC on at the convention hall. So we were drenched by the time we got back to the hotel. So that allowed us to slow down. Went to bed early and then prepared for this weekend. We relaxed for Friday morning and then Got ready, headed over to meet Clarence. Clarence is my husband's childhood friend. And so we met up over there. While they were chit-chatting and catching up, I went ahead to Artist Alley because let me tell you, when I walked into the convention, it was art overload. And I had no problem with that. So yes, we did a lot of cardio because I was running all over the place, up and down Artist Alley. Because they didn't have all of the vendors that they normally do have, they had a lot more artists and a lot more crafters. So there were artists everywhere, not just on Artist Alley. So it was, you, you were just like going ev all over the place. And I was able to get um, a new book series by the author and she signed it for me, which she was really wonderful. I would show you the book, it's in the bedroom for me to relax in the evening. So we made the decision that on Friday afternoon, we were gonna go see John Barrowman. And then afterwards, that actually uh, wound up kicking us out of the Beast uh, panel and the comics pitch because it was at two o'clock and we needed to get in line at 1.30. And we honestly did not get to see him until closer to three. But it wound up once the line started going, everything went quickly. And then we also purchased some artwork that I didn't want to be carrying around while we were seeing Don Barrowman. So we went back to pick that up and then got back to the hotel, got something to eat which we went all day without eating, and then to rest up for Saturday. Saturday, Ashley got over bright and early herself. And instead of doing lunch early, we decided to do food late. So we headed over. Now, I will mention that while I was resting on Saturday, because we did get back to the hotel around 4 or 5 o'clock, my husband really wanted to head back over there and see if he can catch up with Clarence some more. So he did. Unfortunately, Cl Clarence had left. But one of the things that I was trying to find was leather vendors. At cons like these are when I prefer to look for leather artists. Now, you can go to Ren Fairs for those, but... 
I don't get often to Ren Fairs, and a lot of times Ren Fairs are hot, they're outside, and they're dirty, and that just, yes, I'm washable, but you know, I like going to cons. Anyway, when my husband went back, he found Misty Mountain, which is a gaming they create, hand make all of the dice, but they also carry the Peaceful Earth leather. And so I was able to get some amazing pieces. Um, I have one piece from them from five years ago, but it was small. Well, they had a larger one and then they had others. So I spent a lot of my money and time there. And my husband actually was the one taking the photos. I didn't take any photos. I was so wrapped in all the artwork. I didn't even think about taking photos. Uh, we did, by the way, find the gentleman doing all of the beasts of, uh, in Florida, haunted Florida. So we did get to see him. We got books uh, and spoke with him. And he knew a lot about Florida, even though I grew up here that I don't. So at this point, we decided to go ahead and split up. So Steve went with Ashley for John Barman. And I headed to the hotel with all of the artwork. So they went ahead and did the Jean Barrowman photo op and then went to the Q&A panel, which I wish I honestly had done. But I will catch him next time. And then once they all got back, we got Ashley out of her um, corset and everything and headed to Red Lobster, which is down the street. Got back to the hotel. She headed out. We went to bed and then the next morning packed, checked out, and then drove home. Ka-flopped head first, I swear, uh, into bed. All right, these are some of the pieces I got to come home with. This is by Studio Desade. And then this is by Sarah Wilkinson. The art with the angel, I will have to look up hers to give to you. We received or purchased quite a few from Sarah Wilkinson. This one is just very inspirational. I adore it. And then we also purchased some metal art from Lady Metallica. There's one, unfortunately, because I put these up so quickly, the chandelier is glaring out a lot of them, so I wasn't able to get pictures. This is from the artist Chrissy. And then the book series that I purchased from Lauren Jankowski. A bookmarker that is a metal bookmarker, also from Lady Metallica. And then D. Smith created this piece. Wherever you look at it, it shines differently. I want to thank you for joining me. And I hope you enjoyed the artwork that I got a chance to bring home with me. Thank you for spending the time. Don't forget to subscribe, like, ring, click on that bell or ring that bell so that you are updated on more items. I'm going to try and get a nail video out also for today. I hope you have a great week. Talk with you soon. Take care. Stay safe.